At nine, we are following breaking news. A child, yet again, the victim of Chicago's gun violence epidemic. The eight-year-old taken to Mount Sinai Medical Center. WGN's Patrick Elwood is live at the hospital right now with more on this investigation. Patrick. Micah and Ray, tragically, we all know too well, this keeps repeating itself, this narrative over and over again. Another child shot. This time, it involves an eight-year-old who was shot. Early on, so no word on a motive tonight as an investigation unfolds, but as many as 30 shell casing evidence markers could be seen on the street. The crime scene stretch stretching at least a block, and while this child receives emergency care here at the hospital, victims advocate Andrew Holmes once again speaking out, repeating that same message. Somebody needs to turn the shooter in, do the right thing, and if and when that happens, he or she needs to be prosecuted to the fullest extent. These are grown adults running down the street with these guns. These are teenagers running down the street with these guns. So you're discharging that weapon, but on the end of that projectile is somebody's baby. Now this little boy may have been walking, may have been playing, but he had a right to be outside without you discharging that weapon and that weapon hitting him in his body. So we ask him again, who has the heart to come up and say, okay, this is the person that shot the baby. And then when the person shoots the baby, we need the state's attorney to come on with it and start charging these individuals. Because see, if you look at it, these individuals are not being charged. Back here live at the scene, our understanding is the eight-year-old was shot in the knee. Uh, condition has been upgraded somewhat from critical to serious. So it appears at this point he's going to be uh, okay physically. That's the scene here from now, uh, reporting live outside Mount Sinai Hospital. We'll have an update for you coming up at 10 o'clock. But for the moment, Mike and Ray, back to you in the studio.